Sometimes the apps that you need to use together in a Zap don't always share information as smoothly as you'd like. It's almost like they're speaking different languages to each other. When miscommunication happens between apps, that's where Zapier's formatter tool saves the day. Formatter does a bit of everything. It can split up one block of text, reformat a phone number, and dates too. It can parse text to find an email address, convert Markdown to HTML. It does a lot. And we're going to recap the top features now. To go a bit more in depth on these, be sure to check our lesson in Course 101 on Formatter. Transform text. With the transform text action, Formatter makes it simple to change text to title case, make text upper or lower case, extract emails, URLs, or phone numbers. It's an extensive list, but one of the most helpful features is splitting text. Splitting text takes a piece of data, like a full name, and it splits it into different pieces that can be used individually. If a form has a field for a name, but your CRM has fields for first and last names, that's a perfect moment to use formatter split text. Transform numbers. With this, you can change the format of a number, currency, or phone number. One app might give you a phone number with dashes, while another app needs it with periods. Transform numbers can take care of that for you. Formatter's numbers actions can also perform math operations and spreadsheet style formulas, which we'll get into later in this section. Transform date or time. This one is pretty straightforward. Reformat a date or add a time to dates and times. This is especially useful when you have an app that uses the international date format and another using the American style. Formatter will take the date and you get to select which format to use. Remember, you always want to use the output from the Formatter app. That'll ensure that the changes you make are passed through your Zap. In the next few lessons, we'll dig a bit deeper into a few of the Formatter's other tools. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the like button below. And if you're new to this channel and like content like this, consider hitting the subscribe button if you haven't already. Thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next video.